Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well and this video is going to be the second video of my Lush favorite products um, and um, the first one was of the Dream Cream body lotion that is my favorite body lotion um, from Lush and, and in the whole world for me uh, but today this uh, Lush Favorites is going to be on my favorite body butter from Lush and uh, probably for some of you the best one will be Buffy or your favorite will be Buffy because that's very very popular uh, and I think that's uh, probably because it leaves a very thick layer of moisturizing um, again on your skin after you've used it and it's like a medium exfoliator but that's not my favorite I personally I th think that Buffy it's a little bit too greasy afterwards even though I got dry skin um, but it's just really greasy oily feeling um, it's just a little bit too much and it's also um, uh, it is very good though but uh, it leaves um, a little product again in my shower like I got um, glass doors in my shower and they become very greasy after I've used Buffy but I just keep this in the bag and I mark this up here and this is called Acromirabilis it's just a bag from Ikea um, here this is a uh, this is um, uh, the Acromirabilis, the bu body butter. Um, this is not used yet, but I have used two of this one before this. So this is the new one, and I've used two of them before. So I know that they are re really good. Um, they got a little bit more uh, exfoliation than Buffy. Um, I just have to put it down. I can hold it here. Okay, so it got a little bit um, rougher, more exfoliation uh, than Buffy because this one ex is exfoliating with um, what is called uh, Grand Almond Shells. So I don't know if you can see the the small like particles in here. It's like uh, some dark brown spots that it's the um, almond shells grounded. Uh, so the main ingredients, or actually all the ingredients, are a uh, cocoa butter and the difference between this one, the, the main difference between this one and Buffy, of course, the, um, what it's exfoliating with, but also this contains almond butter. Uh, and that it's not that greasy feeling that shea butter does, gives, yeah, whatever. So, okay, uh, ingredients is cocoa butter, almond butter, ground almond shells, sandalwood oil, and rose absolute. So, this is actually not just um, exfoliating and moisturizing, but also calming because of the rose absolute and sandalwood oil is also calming. Um, but, yeah, as um, you probably understand, this one don't give you the greasy layer after you come out of the shower um, like for example compared to uh, ocean salt or rubber rub they exfoliate it with salt and salt is very drying so after I've used that one I just have to put a lotion in the moment I come out of the shower or I will just be yeah my skin will scratch and just feel very tight and very dry uh, it's not a great feeling but they are very good exfoli exfoliators um, but they are dry so this one you don't get the feeling uh, even if it doesn't feel like you have put lotion on or anything but um, it's like an uh, exfoliator without getting you more dry than you are before you use it so it will moisturize your skin, but if you got very dry skin like me, then I probably want to put a little lotion on after I've used this one. Uh, compares of the day and what my skin feels like. Um, yeah, and uh, yeah, one thing, this melts really quickly. So uh, two tips to how uh, you can have it last longer. 
uh, either you can cut it in two right into here or this way um, it's just the same it's a square uh, so you cut it in two and just use a half piece at a time then the whole thing isn't uh, used and I think then it will last longer and also be very careful not to have it under running water because and especially not hot water because then it will melt really fast um, and uh, yeah some um, what is called some information uh, in Norway this is 95 grams and it's 104 crowns uh, and USA it's a 3.3 ounce um, and it's 10.95 US dollars and in the UK it's uh, also 95 grams it, it's the same size so just um, so you understand and uh, 5 pounds 50 so it's um, I think buffet it's a little cheaper but it, it's just so it's just it, it's not that much cheaper it's just a little bit um, I'm going to say yeah um, I don't know I just um, yeah this is my favorite I have used the Buffy I have used this one I have used the uh, use snap to whip uh, but just in the store but I've used it on my whole, whole arm and also I have the king of skin uh, which is without exfoliating um, that's good too but very greasy okay so yeah you see you probably can see that it's already melted just by holding it like this okay so if you're wondering how you use this what do you do um, wash your like uh, take a shower like you usually do wash your hair shampoo conditioner um, and soap on your body and then I use this one when I'm um, when um, uh, what is it called um, when I usually am done and wanted to get out of the shower then I just turn up the water I haven't to towel myself yet and then I take this one and just exfoliate all over my body um, I exfoliate some extra uh, on my legs and my arms and such but that's what you prefer uh, and then I take this out of the shower but I'm still in the shower and then I just uh, shower it quickly off the um, ground almond shells but the, uh, the butters is still on me even if it's not that much and then I go up in the shower and towel and yeah whatever I used to do so it's very easy to use it's no problem um, so yeah, this is absolutely my favorite body butter, but I also like the others. So uh, I hope you like this video, probably if you haven't tried Aqua Mirabilis, I really recommend to try it, and please tell me how you think it was, um, and what you prefer. So yeah, look up for the next Lush Favorites uh, videos, and I'm sure I'm going to be doing some other hauls too, so... Um, yeah, um, see you next time. Bye-bye.